Welcome to Kilson Street's presentation number five. I'm your host, Richard Bernal. We're filming right here from Santa Ana, California. Today we have the pleasure of bringing you a band from Garden Grove, California, Bout Tragedy. Great job, guys. About Tradger. We'll be right back after a short break. Hey, Caleb. Yeah. What's your favorite thing about sucking dick? Uh, a lot of things. Um, I guess the protein count is pretty good. Um, I like the rhythm, you know? Yeah, a lot of good things about it. Because you know you'd be sucking dick, right? <laughs> yeah, I know. I, I'd be sucking dick. Definitely. Dick sucker. Hey, Caleb. Hey, Nate. What's up, man? Hey, not much. Uh, what's your favorite thing about sucking dick? Uh, I guess, like, the sense of community. I don't know. It's pretty fun. Uh, I'll catch you later. Catch you later, dick sucker. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Caleb. Yeah. Hey, quick question. Uh, what's your favorite thing about sucking dick? <laughs> you know, the first couple times were funny, but I'm getting a little sick of this. Like, it's kind of every day, and it's, it's, not, it's, uh, it's not funny anymore. 
Oh, yeah, every day so. when you're sucking dick, it's not fun anymore? <laughs> yeah. You suck dick. 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 Yeah, I guess I, I, I suck dick. Hey, Caleb. Hey, Caleb. Caleb. Yeah. Hey, Caleb. What's your favorite thing about sucking dick? Nothing. Nothing. I don't know. <laughs> Why do you keep doing it, Caleb? Why do you keep sucking dick? Day in and day out, sucking dick, sucking dick. <laughs> hey, Nathan. Hey, Caleb. You will not believe the day at work I had. It's ridiculous. Oh, dude. Tell me what happened. Well, first of all, payroll was all screwed up, so like nobody knew what to do. Accounting was all in a tizzy. Dude, it was just dude, a big mess. Dude, like, dude, dude, that sounds awful. Can yeah, I, it was. It was very awful. Can I ask you like a real quick question now? Yeah. Was yeah uh, what's your favorite thing about sucking dicks? No, I've had it. No, what, what, no, wait, no hey, seriously, whoa. this needs to stop right now. What? What is this obsession with me sucking dick? Like, it's not gonna happen. I'm sick of it. I'm just, I'm angry. Like, just stop, okay? Well, why, why do you keep asking? Well, because you keep sucking dicks. If you, I'm not gay. I'm not even gay happy. I'm just fed up. I'm over it. This is just fucking stupid. Just stop, okay? Just stop. Just stop. It's not funny. Just stop, okay? Just stop. Yeah, no, sir. Yeah, stop. I'm serious. Whoa, 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 hey guys, 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 guys. I heard you guys yelling at each other from downstairs, and you know, seeing we all live together. Yeah. You know, we should try to get along, care about each other. So before you guys let anything get out of hand, I want you guys to look deep down inside and, and ask yourselves, what's your favorite part about sucking dick? All right, we're here with Bout Tragedy. And let's start it off with names and ages. Uh, my name's Adam, 25. My name is Andrew, I am 24. I'm Kent, uh, 22. I don't know my own age. All right, let's start off uh, with uh, how'd you come up with a name? Why not uh, something else? Well, um, let me take this one. All right. <laughs> it's a long winded it's a, story. It's a long story. Okay, so basically we've been playing for so many years, and we still haven't Since found 2009. a name. Yeah, we still haven't found a name. So basically, it's like one day we were partying in the garage, having practice and stuff, and I just looked at a box and another box, and I was so drunk that I said it about Tradger when really I meant to say Badger Trout because one box said Badger and the other box said Trout. So he basically made a portmanteau right up on the spot, and we said, fuck it, we're going to go ahead and use it. Yeah, you know? we thought it was so funny at the time that we couldn't stop laughing, and we just... It stuck, you know. It's not that funny when you're trying to explain to people how do you spell it. So, <laughs> like, this is how you spell it about Tradger. You can go to our website too, bouttragedy.com with the dash. Anybody uh, give you weird names for? Anybody say Butt Ranger? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Someone Bout Trax. You know, like people mispronounce it all the time, but it's Bout Tragedy. Yeah. We we had a party and we had name suggestion bucket, and someone put, uh, "Why don't you be the fuck you think of your own names?" <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like, oh, thanks, guys. Real real helpful. What was the one electric grilled cheese sandwich? No, no. Uh, electric taco. Oh, and, yeah. And British pineapple. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're not even British. Army dude. of the Potomac. That was another one. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, what drives you guys to make the music? Go ahead. Want to take that takers. Serious uh, question. Uh, well, to be honest with you, it's the only thing I'm really good at is like playing music. You know that and. Other stuff, but you know, video games. <laughs> but you know, it's just something that we've been, me and Andy, have been jamming for a while before we brought Adam into the mix. You know, and it's something I've been doing with other bands all all over the place. You know, and then finally we got serious. You know, and we're getting this stuff done. You know. Yeah, Kent. I've known Kent my whole life, and um, I knew Adam since Ocean View High School, and oh. uh, we we would always get. Are you guys brothers? No, we're not brothers, but 
we when we had the the hair out, you know. Yeah, this guy has curly hair like me. He just cut it, but it's like, like we're both we're. But in in terms of inspiration, uh, we got together one night and we wrote this song "Bowl of Meat" together. <laughs> it was really funny, and I said, you know what? Forget this. We need to get a drummer. And I looked to Adam right away because we were in a little band called Sixteen Bit Hero at high school, and. From there, it was magic. We had one other guitarist, but he kind of bounced out, and then we really focused on our three-piece sound, you know, and trying to fill those little gaps and stuff. So, it's got called out. Yeah, uh, I'll just chime in a little bit. Uh, it's just there. I'm I'm not a super creative person, but uh, drumming just it's my creative outlet and gets out aggression, and it's just fun, and it's fun to be around these guys, and we just make music. He's one of the best drummers I know, man. Thanks. Getting romantic over here. <laughs> <laughs> well, might I say this band is actually really cool to hang out with. One of the coolest <laughs> bands I've hung out with, actually. They, they've been here for a while uh, <laughs> with uh, technical dif- difficulties and all that crap. So we've actually got to, you know, hang out for a while. Uh, another thing was that I was checking out a couple bands, and what got me to really like this band was they had a uh, their Facebook page, but they have a Reverb Nation, and their songs are legit, and that just really gets you. Is uh, are you guys getting a lot of shows? No, actually, we're really novices to this scene. We really like Santa Ana. All the bands that we've met have been totally awesome and nice to us. Like just for example, Shogo is the one who started us off. We went to the Shanghai and the Avalon, and um. China Woman was also really uh, freaking great to us, you know. Uh, Dead Quixote was the band that this guy was in, if you want to talk about that a little bit. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was freaking cool, you know. They played a few shows, but when he went into the Grinning Ghost is when we actually started to get into the Santa Ana scene, and it's just awesome. Yeah, I'm kind of a drumming whore. Like, <laughs> I'll, I'll, if anyone out there wants to jam, I'm, I'm, I'm ready. But we, we've, we've been hanging out with these people here after now. Bell Haunts, 87s, Electro City, you know, they're all freaking awesome people. They're all great, you know. We love it. We love it. We just want to be able to play shows with them. You guys should uh, really get this band. The, the energy in the studio was really good. I, for one, am a super fan now. Sweet. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, Ego is sufficiently boost for now. <laughs> hey, girl. All right. Well, is there anything else you guys would like to add? Uh, uh, yeah, I'd, I'd like to mention a couple <laughs> of bands that I I, I, I wanted to throw a shout out to. Um, my buddies uh, in Dark Ale, uh, they're a death metal band, you know. And then also I play in a in a band called Smokestack Lightning, which is blues band. You know, we have a couple gigs every now and then, and also uh, a Twelve Hours Later as well. I just wanted to say that throw, throw a shout out. Uh, also, so you can go to our website about treasure about dash treasure dot com. And we have our music and our shows up there. Throw the sign up again. Right. Um, but you can also see us on all the other social media sites, Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, Google+, MySpace. So we have a SoundCloud that's kind of in the works. But Kent here has uh, Mr. Basic uh, is his tag name. So Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mr. Basic on, on SoundCloud. So it, it would it's spelt with two S's. So M-R-B-A-S-S-I-C. Uh, at you know hashtag at SoundCloud or whatever I don't know how to how <laughs> yeah, the, it works stupid. you know it's dash hashtag dash it's SoundCloud no. dash Mr Basic I got a bunch of techno songs that I wrote and um a couple bass solos of some of our songs you know check it out if you're interested I just want to say like let's all get together and keep booking shows like like AJ was saying I call him AJ Andrew was saying. Like, I like the same, we both, all three of us like the Santa Ana scene. We like what's going on. We just want to keep booking shows, keep it real. I'm home. No, (laughs) exactly. No egos. Just let's all hang out and have fun and play shows. And what happens, happens. Yeah. That's all I want to say. So, yeah. Right on, right on. Well, from all of us here at Kilson Street, we'd like to say a big thank you to you guys. Thank you. And to everybody out there, just keep tuning in. It's as simple as that. Have a good one. Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Thank you. So how's your wife doing? Doing Tom, yoga instructor. That's cool. Had a class with him. How's your daughter doing? Football team. Nice. 
So how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing the head surgeon's wife. Wait, I'm the head surgeon. Yeah, your wife's hot. So, doctor, how was medical school? Medical school? Yeah, that thing you went to before you became a doctor. Dude, I just got out of friggin' community college. Cool. Do you need a scalpel? Yeah. Alright. Fuck, this isn't a scalpel. Budget cuts. Fuck it. Jesus Christ, this guy's vagina's gonna look so nice. Uh, this is his leg. Wait, I thought this was a sex change. No, that's your two o'clock. Whatever. Wait, what do we do with the water pump? I don't know, where'd you put the gasket? Wait, there it is. Oh, cool. Cool. Great. Wait, why are we performing surgery in the garage? Oh, my daughter's having her abortion in the restroom. Oh. Wait, doesn't that bother you? It's not mine. All right. Mm. All right, doctor, I think we're ready to take this fucker out. Nurse? Did you want to go get a sandwich? Uh, sure, let me get his shoes first. All right. Welcome back, and now about Tradger with their self-titled song. Yeah. 
difference 